So this is it, 2003 Silver Corolla Sportivo. Basically stock standard, except for a couple of little parts that I'll touch on later. 16 by 6.5 factory wheels. These were painted up by the previous owner. They're sort of a, a Lexus coloured grey that they use on some of their wheels. I think it looks a lot nicer than the silver that these come in factory. And when the car's moving, they actually look a lot darker. Um, nice touch in my opinion. Bridgestone Potenza RE003s. I've got these on 205 55 16. Standard factory uh, side skirts. Little roof spoiler that they come with. Nothing fancy. Go and have a look at the inside now. Seats are in really good nick. Driver's seat especially, there's no tears or anything in it. This car's done uh, just over 220,000 kilometres. Over there, there's a slight crack in the perforated leather. It's no big deal. It's pretty much been there since I've bought it. Had it for about three years. Hasn't got any worse, so I'm just monitoring it and seeing what's, seeing if I need to do anything with it later. All right, we'll hop inside and have a bit better look. This is the steering wheel it came with. I've noticed different steering wheels on some of these models. Some of them have a big sort of Toyota emblem there, and others are like this, so it's just luck of the draw, I guess. Center console, all these little bins are still in good nick. Paint's all good. The standard factory gear knob it came with, the leather or pleather or whatever it was, wore out on the side in a couple of spots and just felt really dodgy. So I got rid of it and uh, swapped it with a um, TRD gear knob. I got this one from Toyota, so it's a factory TRD gear knob made in Japan. That is a common problem. Those little things break, so um, just holding it in place with blue tack. Nothing else uh, amazing in here, just a standard factory interior really. Everything works, there's no issues with anything. Paint works good on these. Overall, pretty happy with uh, how it's held up over 18 years and 220,000 kilometres. Alright, we're going to have a look at the engine bay. Alright, this is the 2ZZ GE VVT LI with Lift Intelligent. About 141 kilowatts and approximately 190 horsepower. So, um, not a bad little engine, and it sort of makes this otherwise, otherwise ordinary Corolla sort of come alive. The sound it makes is really, really nice, especially above four and a half, five thousand. And then once you hit lift at 6.2 up to 8.2, it uh, just screams, so it's, it's sensational. You can probably see it there. There's a little sort of opening in the airbox at the bottom there. And I've done that to um, enhance the sound that comes out of the uh, intake under acceleration. One of the things I was hinting at before was the coilovers. And uh, they were there when I bought the car. They're XYZ coilovers. Height adjustable. They're Super Street from memory. And can't really see it in there, but um, it's about an inch gap. It's just nice for uh, daily driving. All right, that's about it for the moment. We'll cut to a um, little music piece with some um, shot I did yesterday up at a local national park. So uh, thanks for watching and uh, keep an eye out for upcoming videos. Bye. This could be good for me. 
Lately I was feeling like I need a purpose But when you talk to me Give me the impression that I won't scratch your surface And I could walk for days Searching for your praise But is it even there to find? Me. 